So I would say it's important because we want to limit the spread of the virus. Uh, we want people to be safe. Um, these vaccines are very effective. Basically, if you get vaccinated, um, there's, there's five vaccines approved in Canada. Right now, we're just doing the two or three in BC. Um, after your second dose, you have over 95% reduced chance of getting any mild symptoms of COVID and you're basically almost 100% covered for any serious effects from the virus. So um, these are very great vaccines. Other reasons why we should get it, because we want to be careful uh, and caring of our elders and our young ones in our communities. And I think if we are doing the basic measures of wearing a mask, socially distancing and getting vaccines, we can do a lot of good for our elders in the community, keep them healthy and keep them safe. Uh, as far as concerns about safety with the vaccines, I would just encourage people to reach out to us, uh, the family doctors, um, the nurses in Karasakani Primary Care to, uh, to raise those questions that they have. That The vaccines are, are very safe. They, um, the main ones that we have been giving so far in the Karasakani communities have been the Moderna vaccine and the Pfizer, and they are both um, very safe vaccines. They don't contain any of the virus, so there's, no, there's zero chance that you can catch COVID from the vaccines. Most common symptoms after getting a vaccine would be, like, like any vaccine, flu shot or, or not, um, it would be kind of a local reaction, so some soreness, redness to the arm. Some people um, have a little bit stronger um, reaction from their body where they'll actually get maybe swollen lymph nodes in the armpit area. That's typical for the first shot. If After the second shot, some people do notice that they can get a little bit tired, fatigued, um, still the soreness in the arm and then maybe a little bit of a fever for about the first day or two and those are kind of the most common um, side effects that we would say from the vaccine. These vaccines are very safe, they're important for our community's safety. Uh, I know there are a lot of questions out there about the safety, about the vaccines and uh, the just the development time, like how quick they were approved. Um, I would just say that please come and talk to us uh, and to have those questions answered. Uh, we uh, very much would like to have those conversations with you. Uh, other reliable resources to get some of these questions answered would be the BC CDC website. As we continue to roll with the vaccine, we're, we're hoping that some aspect of normalcy can be uh, attained. Hopefully we'll be able to uh, to be able to socially gather again, meet, meet in our communities and that uh, as, as we approach the herd immunity where we get more people vaccinated and where the numbers of the COVID cases go down. So there is a light at the end of the tunnel. Um, I understand that it's been a long uh, year already and um, we just really encourage people to kind of take personal responsibility and uh, kind of follow the guidelines currently still with the mask wearing, the social distancing and um, getting vaccinated.